the vaults of Aero would discuss a psychedelic experience in a frequently asked questions section. That provides a partial overview of ideas expressed in Timothy Leary's book The Psychedelic Experience, a manual based on the Tibetan Book of the Dead. They classified five levels of the psychedelic experiences. Please note that these levels are not something which I came up with. These are the information from the Arrowwood vaults. And Tim Leary is the legend who came up with this. There are five levels. I will explain which psychedelics will help to achieve those five psychedelic levels. Level 1. This level produces a mild stoning effect. With some visual enhancement like bright colors. Some shorter memory anomaly. Come on, take the ticket. Busy here. Come on, take the ticket. Take it. Take the ticket. I need this, right? I'll remember your face. There is no way you explain this. Left and right brain communication changes causing music to sound wider. Can be achieved with moderate doses of cannabis. Low doses of psilocybin. And moderate doses of certain entactogens like MDMA. Level 2. Bright colors and visuals. For example things start to move and breathe. They chopped the goddamn head off right there in the parking lot, and then they got all kinds of holes in her and sucked out the blood. They wrapped the penal gland, I think. Yeah. Some two-dimensional patterns become apparent upon shutting one's eyes. Closed, and you just have this explosion of color or patterns behind your eyes. You know, you close your eyes. Confused or reminiscent thoughts change of short-term memory leading to continual distractive thought patterns. Vast increase in abstract thought becomes apparent as the natural brain filter is bypassed. Can be achieved with very high doses of cannabis. Low to moderate doses of psilocybin. Low to moderate doses of mescaline. Normal doses of MDA which has a much more psychedelic effect than MDMA. And from normal doses of intactogenic psychedelics of the 2C family such as 2CB and 2 Court 7. Level 3. Very obvious visuals. Sweet isn't ready yet, but someone was looking for you. <laughs> Everything looking curved and warped. Patterns and kaleidoscopic view on walls, faces, etc. And if you take a uh, tour, it's even more crazy. Look at that. Some mild hallucinations, such as rivers flowing in wood grains. <laughs> hallucinations become three dimensional. There is some confusion of the senses. For example, seeing sounds as colors, time distortion, and moments of eternity body movement becomes difficult and disorienting. There is a heightened sense of awareness of one's own feeling and drive people. Whoa. What is happening to me? Where is this? Where am I? Am I dead? Am I, am I still alive? Those aren't the questions you should be asking. Huh? Who reach level 3, usually report it as thought-provoking and life-changing. For some people who reach level 3, their ability to discern is somewhat thrown off. People who reach level 3 and higher are more likely to respond to suggestive thoughts at such a level. It is recommended that there be a trip sitter to watch over the tripper just in case he or she would do something that would be a potential hazard. Can be achieved with moderate to high doses of psilocybin. 
high doses of mescaline. And normal doses of LSD. Level 4. This level is categorized by strong hallucinations such as objects morphing into other objects. There are many subtypes of these hallucinations manual broad patterns, spirals and wave interference patterns. Another characteristic is the destruction or division of the ego. It's been said that experiencing ego death can feel as though you are literally dying in the physical sense. After experiencing ego death, many psychonauts come back with a whole new understanding of their subjective reality. It can be as though they had visited a Satori-like state and they come back with a whole new appreciation for life. Things may start talking to you or you find that you are feeling contradictory things. Yeah, I'd like to order one large person with extra people, please. White people. No, 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 no. Black people. And Simultaneously, some loss of reality is prevalent. Well, things were happening all around us. Mm. Where are some golf shoes? Otherwise, we'll never get out of this place alive. Time becomes meaningless. Out-of-body experiences and extrasensory perception type phenomena are common as is a blending of the senses. Visuals containing imagery of the Hindu, Aztec, Mayan, Native American, Indian and African cultures are quite common. Can be achieved with high doses of LSD. And very high doses of psilocybin. Level 5. Among the classical psychedelics, only the tryptamine such as DMT. And extremely high doses of psilocybin can induce level 5 experiences. However, some atypical psychedelics like salvinorin A, found in salvia divinorin and Ketamine can also induce level 5 experiences at high doses. Experiences include total loss of visual connection with reality. The sense of not being human or having a body the loss of reality is so extreme that... that it becomes ineffable people have reported seeing themselves in entirely different settings than their original setting. And many people experience the feeling of being in a simulated reality. Often computer simulated religious phenomenon is reported at this level. Often mentioned is a connection to the all-knowing presence or universal knowledge which many equate with extraterrestrials artificial intelligence God love or enlightenment uses commonly report one being clearly thrust into outer space at extreme speed to being thrust into an expansive void. Like, alternate dimension consisting of bright colorful fast moving kaleidoscope environments dynamic, pulsing color beams as well as complex three-dimensional geometric mathematical and linguistic patterns made of light. Three continually traveling at great speeds, while watching patterns flying by more open and reveal more complex patterns within or encountering different types of living beings and super-intelligent body-less entities at the same time. As one, two and three these reports include contact with three floating entities made of light, resembling giant spheres. Humanoids multiple types of unrecognizable insects. Human-sized ants. Mantises elves. Cephalopods. Complex robotic machines. And plants. Beings attempting to communicate with users via visual linguistics mathematics. Morphing color diamonds of different textures, flesh gold, liquid metal, colored light. People report beings and entities manipulating what they can see and view propelling them in different directions at disorienting speeds and forcing them to view both macro and microscopic scale objects. Objects include planetary systems, galaxies, quasars, natural environments, space habitats, technological utopias, neurons, DNA, mitochondria, trilobites, cephalopods, 
Riozoa and artificial self-replicating machines. Most users report similar auditory pattern of a combined high-frequency whine and a slow deep throbbing tone similar to a heartbeat. Most DMT users report feeling frequently uninhibited clear-headed while experiencing peak effects and able to maintain the ability to think and reason in the above circumstances.